mean, well, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. If it's in the same round, it's got to be. But yeah, just, I guess Suarez got to make his controls. Yeah, thanks for your patience, guys. We'll be in the action soon enough. <laughs> Smelly Subway Super Smash Bros. <laughs> Thank you, autocorrect. <laughs> What's that? Never heard of it. Looks like they're about to start. What stage do you think they're going to go to first? Looks like Pokemon Stadium 2 is the choice. Solid starter stage. I think uh, th this is a matchup where both characters, after game one, I think they have like very like obvious stages that they want to go to. Lucas wants to go to stages like probably Stadium, Kalos, FD, FD yeah. um, Town. Big stages. How with about Yoshi? I'm interested to hear your opinion on that. I don't think he'd want to go to either Yoshi stages. No, I mean Yoshi the character. Oh, Triplats. Okay. Triplats, Smashville. Uh, Yoshi's Brawl, which is legal here. Right. Lilat. I don't know about Lilat, actually. It's weird. That's a stage that can go either way. Um, All right. So Neko's locked in, waiting on Suarez. What color does he play? Blue, I think. <laughs> there it is. All right. Looks like we're about ready to get going. Kind of looks like safe. I guess so. They're probably um, discussing what music each other's <laughs> gonna play. Yeah, they're taking the time for sure. We got we got Mecco's again. Booting thanks up for your patience, guys. Super Dragon Ball Broly movie soundtrack. <laughs> Mecco's putting on his power up music. <laughs> oh no, that's too early. He's got a yeah. No, he doesn't have to power up yet. He's he's starting in base form. Does Suarez have any other characters besides? Uh, Not Yoshi? that I know of. And everyone knows that Mechos only goes Lucas. Uh, Mechos does have a Mario secondary. Does he uh, really? Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I would be surprised to see him pull it out here, but we'll we'll see how the set progresses. I think uh, I think it's you know a lot of people think that Yoshi beats Mario, so it's probably not gonna happen. And it's Mechos, it's probably not gonna change anyway. It's gonna go Lucas, get the experience. He's a he's a tried and true Lucas man for sure. Yeah, since brawl. All right, so right, like we said, starting on Stadium. <laughs> Both of their heads are so low. I'm interested to see how the projectiles interact in this matchup. It's a very good, uh, very good Yoshi bread and butter is just F tilting combos into just vertical movement. Yeah, the F tilt to up tilt into the up airs was what he did there. Is really quality B and B there. Okay, and that PK freeze really deadly in this game will kill off the sides. Such early percentages, such a good edge guarding tool. Good approaching shields from uh, Suarez. Not really getting pushed away. He's not, he can't get in the. What range do you think Yoshi wants to be in? I would say probably right outside of a um, of Mekos' uh, forward air range. Just like the normal is the grab range. But yeah, so he wants to be close enough to be able to punish the whiff normals. But he also wants to be careful of PK fire. Yeah, because it looks like Lucas there and his fair are really good against keeping him out. But um, ooh. I love the way Suarez is using shield. Wow, nice. what a great up smash. Um, yeah, the way he's approaching in neutrals, it seems he's getting a hit and he's approaching with shield and then tentatively using Nair, just trying to poke out Mechos. That was and a it's very working out really well right now. That was a very slow start and then just an explosion of damage. For sure, Yoshi definitely runs with momentum really well. So. Oh, I I agree absolutely. And there's another Nair that's really putting in work. Yoshi shield, not able not able to be shield poked. So it should be good against um, Lucas's multi head moves, I think. Looks okay. like Suarez is uh, landing with Nair a little bit too much, and Mechas is catching on to it. There's two two Nairs in a row. Okay, there it is. Yeah, that PK fire just catch him out of his jump. He could tell what he wanted. He was trying to punish that start up there, but just a little too slow there. Okay, Ooh. down tilt to the grab. Back throw, not going to do it. The classic. Old reliable is what Mechas calls it. And Lucas' up throw should start killing relatively soon. I wouldn't think quite just yet, but... Uh, actually, I could see it killing a moment. Let's see. Fourth throw. No, no oh, throw. Up throw. Yeah. I forgot about that. I was that. thinking he was, well, yeah, I was just saying up throw, but fourth throw is right at the ledge, so I wasn't. 
wasn't quite sure, but Lucas here we doesn't go really have stock. a down throw kill confirmed anymore, does he? No. Ooh. They're super arming through it, um, doesn't get any knockback. It still eats Lucas's it. down throw is now pretty susceptible to just outwards DI, to my knowledge. But we saw him get an up air follow up there. He saw I was just not quite aware of that. That's just one thing that Yoshi has. If you try to air dodge past him, he can still put out an air and his tail's gonna hit you and just send you just as far. These eggs. Carrying a wall for Suarez to approach behind. Okay, Ooh. that option is just catching the jump. Really smart, though. Yeah, he's uh, watching Mecco's PK fire and just ran under him and up smashed. You don't want to get into a rhythm of throwing out projectiles because the other person can just punish you hard for it. Ooh, good jumping around. Not really committing to anything, kind of waiting to see what Mecco's would do. Oh, there it is there's again. The F tilt. Back hit in air into F tilt. Mecco's really trying to fight his way back on. and. The Yoshi grab coming out a little bit quicker than the Lucas grab. I'm surprised they didn't clash. That's like a, you know, smash. Yeah, up that's a good point. Okay, up air. One more up there will do it for sure. Mecco's applying a lot of horizontal pressure, but Suarez Ooh. sneaking Oh, he's high. dead. Gone. Oh, yep. man. Nice from Suarez. Great offstage pressure there. Yoshi's recovery itself may not be the greatest, but... If you're high enough for him to be able to safely come back by just floating with eggs, he can just he just throw out moves. He also has fantastic aerial mobility, so even if he doesn't get the initial burst of horizontal speed, he'll have it eventually. He just drift back, yeah. Right. And that egg gives him so much drift. The very first one is like an, an entire third jump. It's right. Cool. All right, same characters. I imagine that Mechus is going to go to one of those. What stage did he pick? I didn't see. I didn't see either. So FDU is my best guess. Yeah, <laughs> of course. I wonder why he didn't ban it. Uh, um, the Yoshi players that I'm familiar with aren't aren't afraid to go into FD. So, I guess Suarez is not not an exception to the rule here. And they're starting on FD. Maybe he's just as confident that he can throw eggs at the same range they can get PK fired at. I mean, he seemed to be playing pretty well in neutral in that first game. So yeah, let's see and, what that's, happens. and that's just pretty much FD with two platforms. Ooh, good fair. Hit him in the noggin. Okay, Mecca's being patient here. Yeah, throwing out safe normals, not really committing to anything. Ooh, gets caught rolling in. Oh, he might die. Oh, he's got to jump. This is scary. He's okay. Good recovery. Looks as far as wanted to punch him, he's like, I might die if I do this. Right, yeah. Just mutual respect there. Let Mecco's come back on. It's pressuring that uh, Lucas up. He's kind of scary. He can drag you with the multi-hit into the stage. It can be pretty difficult to attack. So. Talking about uh, Yoshi's down air? Or no, Lucas's Lucas is up. Okay. All right. Suarez jumping up in the air. Mecco's not quite able to punish the landing. Gets an egg lay. Ooh. Okay. Like, like the damage there from the down B. That's a, that's a lot of damage. I, if I'm not, he was probably trying to read like the the breakout and hit him because if I'm yeah. not mistaken, up smash does more damage. Just turn around and up smash him. Ooh, catches his fair. Do you have a jump? No, but he air dodged just close enough to make it back. That was close. I find Yoshi players like to mix up what they go for out of the egg late simply just due to uh, like just a different timing mix up. Um, but yeah, not able to get the kill from the egg lay there, but yeah, it's one of the situations. He's working where towards it for sure. Ooh. Goes off goes with the reverse edge guard. That yeah, there it is. Hitting. This should be it. Lost his jump. Oh, yep, he nice. almost made it back. That was great awareness, awareness from Mecco's off stage. Oh, God. We're all, we almost died. We're good. All right. Woo. All right, guys. We're good. Our lives flashed before our eyes. T-Rex saved the day with his big old arms. The banner almost came down upon us. That would have been awful for them playing. Yeah. But luckily, he was he Mecco's was and Suarez anyway. unfazed. Yeah. And Mecco is still on his, riding his first stock. On that, Ooh. oh, that F-Tilt clipping the pull-up from Lucas from his tether. And back air will not Oh, he doesn't die? Stock. Oh, he's going super far. I love the aggression from Suarez off stage. He's not committing too far, but he's going quite far enough to pressure Mekos when he's trying to come back. Here we see Mekos' crazy adaption. Now he's just refusing to die. He's unkillable. Like I was saying, he comes back stronger. <laughs> he does. The near-death experience. Goes too high, doesn't get anything. That was a really well spaced PK fire, but um, Suarez with the with the shield. You know, Looks like Suarez that. is kind of trying to find a back air. He's he's landed quite a few, but not quite able to take the stock. That goes his DI up into the top corner of the blast zone, able to keep him alive, even at almost 150 here. Oh! No, wow! Wait. The, the jump armor. That's what it was. 
Because oh, yeah. that should have sent him flying, as that did. But The jump armor like reduces knockback as well like that? That's weird. Oh, he almost broke his shield. I thought it did. Yeah, I mean, because you see when, when, when moves... I'm sure you're familiar when a move will break the Yoshi jump armor, it'll still hit him slightly away. It just oh. won't kill him. Okay, yeah, it makes but sense. But Neko's going to secure that kill, and he has a full stock lead right now. He smacks him with the PK Great adaptation fire. We, we're seeing. He oh, gets nice. a down tilt into the jab, confirmed. Yeah, too low a percent. I probably can't, doesn't really true comp with the jab. Ooh. And it looks like Mekos, after waiting a while to commit to any hard punishes, is now being much more deadly with his punishes. He's going for nice. more aggressive uh, boxing tools. Okay. Another thing is like, uh, like I said when we started, I'm surprised that Suarez didn't ban the stage because he's not, he's having a big problem like trying to close the distance. Yeah, especially when he was able to, Mekos was able to lock in that lead and Suarez is chasing him around the stage like he's doing right now. Mekos has no reason to approach in this situation. Lucas with the lead okay. is a really good character. Oh, nice egg bounce. Oh, but that fair catching his jump from ledge. He's, I find that's waiting. a safety option a lot of players like to choose. Like we just saw right there, is they'll, they'll pick a, a ledge option, and if they're not punished for it, they'll try to jump out of the corner. Ooh! And Suarez is able to catch it right when he needs to. He okay, went for the up air and the up tilt. Egg not quite able to catch the neutral getup, but Suarez has not let Mekos out of the corner in quite a long time. No, and Mekos. here he's keeping the pressure up. There oh. it is, wow. Did he jump off? Yeah, he let, he let, he let go. Okay, nice catch. Nair. Nair quite, not quite the same combo tool was in Smash 4. Ooh. Oh, they're almost at the wow, same percent. Wow, yeah, what a comeback. we He's already seen. And we are dead even right, dead even. But as I say that, Mecha was landing that PK fire. He hit him like four times. And we are approaching the two-minute mark. I it's wouldn't imagine we're going to go to a timeout, but we're... Oh, is that it? No, but I think he's Oh, go. my... But oh, fair. wow. He's not good. quite. He's wow. a thick boy. Let's he see. Yeah, the drift from Yoshi there after the air dodge. Be able to keep him scary. safe. Just needs to avoid those eggs. Mekko oh, probably Mekko's wants to grab. Was looking for the grab. As far as just playing near the ledge, which is also like a double-edged sword. Gets hit by a PK fire, he could dive to the side, but if he plays near the ledge, it's really easy for him to avoid getting grabbed. has to be careful, though, because if he guesses wrong one time, <laughs> he could lose the game. Yeah, and if Suarez wins, we don't know if this is the best of five or not. This could be Mekos' tournament stock after having such a strong lead for so long. F oh, tilt just not getting the sweet spot. Wait, what? How did that, that, was, that was jump armor again. Oh my gosh. Backer. Is that going to be it? Oh my oh gosh. Oh my goodness. The DI from these players in this set are the so good. Biggest head. Oh, the back air. Oh, oh, they, oh, if he just committed to the dash grab, I think he might have been able to get it. Oh, lots of rolling coming out from Mekos. He oh, really does not want to get back oh, there. Do it. oh, I thought it was a Yoshi oh. back here, but it was a fair from Lucas. It was hard to say. It was, it, was, it was really hard to say. And we went all the way down to 50 seconds in that match. Oh, Mekos with a sigh of relief. But he's not out of the woods yet. He's still got at least one more game. He's powering up. So I, I would imagine that now Suarez is going to want to go to either Yoshi's Brawl, Smashville, Battlefield. Is Yoshi's melee legal yeah. here? Okay. Yoshi's sorry. Yep. That's what I thought. Good guess. Yeah, it's, I mean, like, we were talking about how well Yoshi combos vertically. Right. And that's just, like, these those stages are really good for him. And what does Lucas do, right? Yeah, Lucas not the best vertical kill option, so we didn't see him go for a single up air to kill in that set. And also, not only can Yoshi, like, combo upwards, drop through platform aerials, and also just being able to down beat through platforms or not right. fall through them if you choose not to is just really good. He's also got the home field advantage here. Yeah, he's got the music and old Packy Durham in the background with the sign says stop. Ooh, missed a grab. The egg lay. Nice. I feel like he's just, like... Mashing the jump button, so please help. It is Yoshi's strongest escape tool. What what frame is this in there? Like three? Yoshi's? Yeah. I want to say four or five. Ooh, nice. Yeah, there's that down B. Okay, Suarez getting back to the stage. Mekos with a very juicy lead right now. Doing a good job. 
Down smash, I love the read, but not quite able to time it. Something we see uh, Suarez have done oh, a lot. Oh, I thought he wasted his jump there. It's scary. Something Suarez has been doing a lot is just air dodging to ledge, and Mechus, although not punishing it, isn't really letting him stay on the... Oh, there's the killer down smash. Hits him with the what are those. Sends Yoshi's shoes goodbye. All right, full stock lead for Mechos. Same thing we saw last game. Just went for he it. He is in a no dire need to approach right now. He's just staying patient and punishing the overcommitments from Suarez. Down. Oh my gosh. Oh, excuse me. Forward air going to spike him down. Okay, nice patience on the ledge. That was a good pivot grab. <gasps> okay, nice air dodge from Mechos. That's a, he used his jump. Good down smash. That might be it. No, Egg, yeah, fighting back. his way back on. Oh, nice. There's an up air. Good patience. They both waited and Mechos pulled the trigger first. This seems to be aiding Yoshi's recovery. He's able to just go high and just then throwing on recover stage. with the down B. Back hit in air. Front hit in air. Oh, he went so deep. Yeah, right. what an awesome edge guard there. Okay, Yoshi without a jump, air dodging directly to the ledge there. But Mecho is not letting him up. Jeez, he don't think he has a jump. He's only got eggs. Nice. Mecho is pulling the trigger on these down smashes. Maybe it has to do with the sloped ledge. That yeah, he is probably, really going for these uh, down smashes. It probably places the down smash even further down than it normally Yeah, there's would. another one. And any grab from Lucas will absolutely take the stock right now. But Suarez, oh, yeah, gets the counter hit there. Now that I think about it, wouldn't the ledge mess up his down smash because it puts him higher than what his opponent actually is at? I think when he's standing upon the, the, the top of the slope, he's able to fire the down smash downwards and hit below the ledge, but I'm not really sure. That's a Mecco's question. Oh! oh. oh. Yeah, that weird uh, trade with the back are going to spike Mecco's down. But yeah, hitting the multi-hits when they don't connect properly, they just spike your opponent. That could have almost evened up the game. Oh, wow, gonna get the star KO and Suarez is even the game right back up. Yeah, the, he's been behind pretty much the entire time, but he's like definitely not showing any sign of weakness. Maybe he can put some cracks into Mechus' armor. Just patiently falling, trying to just get back to the ledge, just safety. Good. Catches the aerial, hits him with the PK fire, pushes him back away. Well, there we go. Big damage. Suarez, unfortunately, really hasn't been able to take advantage of the platforms on the stage that he picked. <gasps> wow. Good God. If it for a dash attack, he might have hit him. His grab is just so slow. Good up air. Or not good up air, but you know, the up air is a faster way to land than trying to tech. Smash. Is he going? Oh, oh no, wow. Going for Just it. evens the game with that, but. Oh, he really did. That goes keeping the stock. Ooh, there's the. See, this time they clashed. Yeah. Weird. Odd. That goes not going to commit to a grab too much. S scared of that back air threat. Ooh. That would have been. Um, man, this game is so close. And we still don't know if this is like best of three or best of five. No. That's almost as exciting as finding out. That goes searching with his up air. Is the back air is going to do it for Suarez. Looks like we're keeping the set going. Yeah, it looks like a best of five. That's crazy. Mechos was in the lead that entire game. Yeah, Suarez just never, there. never faltered. But now he can't go back to that stage. So I'm, I don't think they're going to go back to Battlefield. Um, or if, you know, if Mechos... Well, he can't go back. Mechos can't go back to FD. Yeah, but he can go to Kalos and Town. Depends on the bands, of course, but... I, I seriously doubt that we'll see Battlefield in the set. I'm expecting Kalos or... Uh, I can see a game, maybe a Game 5 potential Suarez counterpick. Patrick? Something loud going on back there. Yo, Suarez is fit, looking clean right now.
Okay, we're we going back now. Town and city. Uh, they're hovering. They're hovering a lot of stages right now. <laughs> I think Mecha says I don't know any of the stages. I think he's gonna go Kalos. What do you got your money on? I would think Kalos is a ban, so I can see maybe Smashville. Did he already win on Smashville? Not. I don't know. Maybe it's modified DSR. Okay, we're going back. Wow. Yeah, that's surprising. I would never want to go to Triplice. Shout out to Xander Mobis. Great voice action. Why? Oh, I don't know. I just, what? Heard, I just heard Yoshi, and I was like, oh, that's a good, that's a good, good line. I, I like good it. line. I like it. I, I approve. Anyways, we're going to start game four on Yoshi's Island. Excuse me, Yoshi's Story yet again. Ooh. So I was literally about to mention, Mechas doesn't look like he's parrying any of the egg tosses. Um, not that he gets much advantage off, but Tawars is like, bah, parry right away. Nice nair. Trying to follow up. Mechus' jab combo, always a reliable get off me option. Yeah, he's been using it a lot in this set. Yeah, either out of down tilt or just trying to catch spot dodges. And slow committal, too. You know, if you get the first two hits, you can even get a grab sometimes. Ooh, nice. Sweeping. These Yoshi chases are so nice. He's hitting those ankles, and he's like, get off her. Ooh, that, did he jump? <gasps> That's it. Oh, no. I, Ooh, I guess it was the jump armor yet again. Because that. That move would be annihilating him if he was another character. Dodges this one. Okay, but Mecha's still keeping him at bay. Suarez just out here playing mini games, trying to avoid Mecha's PK freeze. Nice. And Suarez has not been able to secure a kill out of it, but oh, he gets one. it anyway from the forward air to the up air. Really strong combo there. Oh, but down just smash bringing finally. Right back. Finally, Mecha's getting a down smash to connect. Yeah, he was hitting them all the time in the last game, and now he really hasn't um, kind of fell off. Now we're back. Good old Mecha's. That was a really well-spaced bear, but Swalry still managed to get the punished. Both characters throwing out their aerial grabs. Mecha's putting out good pressure on the back of Suarez's shield, dropping his shield, possibly trying to get the parry, just getting hit. It's really interesting to see the way these characters box at each other once they get in each other's faces, because they have the ways to keep each other out. They also have the really uh, fast close range option. It seems like Yoshi's winning the close Ooh. round of battles. Wow. Um, so something interesting about Yoshi, um, excuse me, Lucas's down smash. Wow, what a chase! Is that if you shield the first hit, correct me if I'm wrong, but if you shield the first hit, the other two hits, hits the hitbox is just is not there anymore. Did you say down smash? Yeah, I think I think that's right. At least Yoshi's was, down smash just no 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 Lucas. Lucas. Yeah, no, it's because I, it lingered because he he did a get up into hit. it, but he didn't shield it. I could be wrong though. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. Like, it hits once and doesn't hit again. Like, links up the... Right. Um, yeah, I think, I think it's a fair comparison. I could be ooh. wrong. Though. Okay. Good trade. That's Suarez a great trade taking Suarez. the lead yet again. Mecco seems to have the percentage lead, but Suarez, at these kill percents, is able to seal it out stronger. And, uh, oh, was that up air? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Both players laughing there. Even up, um, evening up the game. I think the one thing Mecco's is just lacking a little bit is I feel like he just needs to commit to his advantage a little more. Which Yoshi is a character that can escape from your combos yeah, we've, pretty well. We've so you, seen you have to be ready. We've seen him consistently just jump out of disadvantage. And Mecha's, you know, he's not a fast character, so you can't really follow him. Right, but just keeping the positioning ready for where Suarez wants to come after using his escape option. That's another thing why I'm not sure I agree with the triplats, because because Suarez is able to escape to these platforms. Yeah, he's so many options. And Yoshi, um, excuse me, Lucas does not jump uh, high or fast enough to get up there in time. And yeah. Suarez now controlling the neutral really well with these eggs, but that goes still the slight lead. Yeah. Okay, oh never God. mind. Lots of damage. Good grab, good grab. A man better than I. I would have gotten hit. 
Good stuff. Stuffing the forward air with his own. That slight startup on the Yoshi forward air. The bane of him right now. He doesn't want to put himself in too much lag because Yoshi can just fall down with any. <gasps> oh bed. my god! Oh. Grab the ledge. Both players coming back safely. Just great drift back forward air. on that forward air and the shield. <gasps> wow, oh my gosh! That was such a great mix-up, but not going to seal the stock for him. Do you think the curve of the stage helped? Back air? Oh, he's still alive. Wow, again. Still he's going living. super deep. You know what? I haven't seen Mechos done at all. Down air. That's true. Like, just to put pressure. Come on. Come on, Mechos. Give us a game five. Nice. Keeping him off stage. Got the stage control. Oh! oh there it is. Wow. Very clutch for Mechos. I like the zoom in on Lucas's eyes. He's angry. He was like, no. Oh. <laughs> Moments after he down here. Is that your Lucas impression? <laughs> no, that particular. He's just like, fuck. Oh. <laughs> Playing in dirt again, Lucas. You eating worms again, Lucas? Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Lucas, look at he, Lucas, he plays in the dirt. You say he, he plays in dirt? He plays in the dirt. Oh, sure, for no. sure. He's a farm boy. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. He's a country boy. He's a good old, good old, he and his brother Klaus. Anagrams. We love him. Bananagrams. It's a fun game. Oh, uh, Mother 3? I haven't played no, it. No, Bananagrams. Oh, I've, I've Mo what? Mother 3 is also very fun. It, I've, see, I've always seen Bananagrams at Barnes & Noble, but I've never played it. It's a fun game. I used to play with my grandma. Oh, but yeah, Mother 3, awesome game also. Um, Shout-outs to our boy Lucas. Alright, so here we're going to see... Mechos go into his final form. I mean, we'll see. To try to take down the... See if uh, he has to go Super Saiyan God. The Mechian Menace. All right, we're at, we got KK Hour Saturday night. It's it is Saturday out, night. It's lit out here at Momocon. Thanks for joining us, guys, again. Yeah, you really should come out to this at least once in your life if you're on the East Coast. It's Absolutely. definitely... It's like one of the three big three events you want to go to, CEO, uh, Momocon, and SmashCon, in that order, in my opinion. Actually, no, Momocon first. Yeah, I wasn't... I don't know if there's an order. Who won in uh, Who won in Smashville last time? Did they play in Smashville? I don't know. We talked about it being all hazards off, and I don't know if that was this set or Lazy set. I'm not sure. But we definitely I talked know about Mechos it. went game two to FD. Game no, because stadium. it was Stadium, yeah, FD, right. Yoshi's Yoshi's. So right. yeah, this is the first time on Smashville. Yeah. And I can't even hear the music. But oh my god! Neither can it Lucas. It is a cold night <laughs> in hell for Lucas. Wow. I think Just the music is the crickets. Spikes the abyss. Yeah, I, yeah I couldn't tell if that was background noise or not. No, I, I, I guess I've never heard this song. Yeah, I haven't either. This is weird. But Suarez is sub. doing exactly what I was saying Mecco should do next, last game. Is He's just putting on the pressure and he's not letting up. Yeah, good down to that ledge. Oh, wait, what? That, that move used to put him in free fall, but not anymore. That's some, that's awful. Why? Did you say why? <laughs> I mean, I don't think uh, PK Free should put him in free fall. But anyway, we're still... Oh, hits with the still bounce. Still, trying to bring this comeback. We've seen Suarez consistently be the one who has to bring these games back. And this time he's right got the now lead. it's Mechos. Yeah, let's see how well Suarez can keep a lead because Mechos. Oh, the last results game Mechos have varied for Mechos. Results may vary. He's trying to catch him. Oh, oh what the? If I was Suarez, I wouldn't have gone down to punish him either. Yeah, no, that's a scary, scary situation. Ooh, he went for the up smash. He's consistently gotten those. This might be the first time he's missed it. Oh, did you jump because you thought I was going to hit him? <laughs> Sorry, I just got the chills there. Oh, there it is. Up smash. That trying to get it, it, like you just said. Okay, if he can freeze, he's going high. Even a broken clock is right twice a day. If he does two more times, he'll do it. Man, Mechos really needs to steal the stock. Down air him. Yeah, he doesn't like the downer, I guess. Yeah, it's odd because I feel like it's a move that he used to do out of shield a lot in the last game. Kind of like snakes. Yeah, it's a Kinda lot like Pac like Man. Snake, Pac Man. Some other character, Rano. Good up air, F2 pressure. Dang. Mecco's consistent with that DI on the Yoshi back air. Yeah, is that since uh, up into the side? That's where he's going, it looks like. That's where he's going. <laughs> I think it can kill off the top. So Mecco's is DIing to the side, so he doesn't die off the top as early as he would be. Ooh, nice turnaround. It looks like Suarez was going to go in. He's like, wait, that's coming back this way. I don't want to know that. 
Lucas has some tricky projectiles. Ooh, nice! He turned around and fell on backward. And these these next few interactions are going to be important because if Suarez seals out this kill immediately, then dang, there it is. Well, I'll let the game speak for itself, I guess. He's been trying to kill him with that so so much. <laughs> and then back air, is, I, I think that's back. really helpful for Yoshi in ultimate. Is he has that backer that he can go for at these high percents, like a ZSS, like a bayonetta. It, like that's his go-to kill option at high percents. Me oh man, okay, he dropped the shield. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, nice. goes patient, not going for the grab, doesn't want to get punished. Perfectly spaced F tilt, wait for him to throw out the jab. I think Mekos is playing especially careful with the spot dodge, but I don't. Uh, that's that, that's uh, that's why I think he's he's waiting. He's waiting yeah. when Suarez does a move. And waiting for the spot dodge at that range. But also Suarez hasn't to spot dodged. No, but he's jabbing a lot, which is about the same like time I would say, throwing out jab. But if Mekos stays out of the range of jab, then he's able to get a free punish. Yeah, he covers both. I mean, his patience is paying off here. He hasn't taken much. Too much damage in his uh, last stock. Yeah, he can. This is a. Uh, I mean, this, this is his tournament stock right here. Oh, nice read. But the tech chase from Suarez keeping it going. Nice grab. Ryoshi with momentum, scary. Very common tactic I see with uh, these floaty characters. They'll go for like a big hit, kind of fall off stage and grab the ledge, since they usually won't die from not being able to recover. And Suarez just really just this taking his lead as far as he can. Mekos getting that down smash. Wow, that air dodge from Suarez not spaced quite well enough. Mekos takes Suarez to his last stock, and we are. This we set are has out been here. back and forth. For sure. From the very beginning. Oh, nice. Oh, my goodness. Doing only 27%. <laughs> yeah. That was three hits, to be fair. And one of them was Zare, so. Yeah, so if that was three hits, he did about 27%. He just needs to do that. Three more times to even up the game. But oh, is that it? Looks like Dang, we'll have no even games. We'll have a great finish from Suarez. Going to take that game. Feels so anticlimactic with no music. Yeah. Kind of disappointing almost. I think they should run that.